So Jerry, how do I look? Yeah, you look fine, Carmen. So I'm already rolling. Whenever you're ready. Bitch. I heard that. Remember, Jerry, I'm the talent. Good morning. This is Carmen Miranda for CMN TV Channel 18 reporting on the sixth annual zombie walk now underway. With us today is one of the organizers, Mr. Mm. Where is Mr. Um? Okay, funny guys, I can deal. The Zombie Walk is a national event taking place in cities across the country. Anyone may participate, young or old, dead or undead. As in past years, this year's event is also a food drive. It's not required, but participants are asked to bring canned good donations, or you may bring yourself. It's sort of funny when you think about it, humans bringing food, donations to an event where the humans are basically food. It's all in good fun, of course. Quite the turnout. Back on me. Has an excellent question, Virgil, and the answer is no. You see, zombies, they don't need any formal training. They are, they're sort of all natural, but they do mimic others. They're, they're considered to be training. Perfect example. Watch this. <laughs> Ooh, excellent blind sign. The newer zombies will mimic the same season dead tactic. Classic. <laughs> By grabbing their ankles, escape is further deterred. Now, the only thing left with this decide is who strikes first and where. Where? <laughs> oh, yes, yes. You see, um, zombies, they, uh, some of them go for the guts. Others, they go for the succulent neck. So. And others, they go for the gold. Gold? <coughs> gold? Brains. Oh my. Well, folks, it looks like we have an exclusive. Um, can't believe those guys over at NBC. Well, anyway, it looks like the only way to kill a zombie is through the brain stems. Oh my, um, crap, they don't pay me enough for this. Okay. Anyway, um, training, mimicking. No, Jerry! Jerry, help! Come, you never look better. Yes, they do mimic. 